Well, good Sunday morning to you, Chet. Hopefully everything is going well with your weekend. You've had a fantastic Saturday evening. You're waking up, maybe having breakfast with your, your family. Maybe you're European, uh, European and having lunch with them, maybe dinner. I don't know how time zones work. It confuses me. The earth is flat after all. So I think it's all just a bunch of hocus pocus. But I'll tell you this much. No matter how your day is going, whether it's morning, afternoon, or night, whether it was a shitty weekend or a great one, it is most definitely better than Andy Worski's weekend at this time. Oh, we have got a story for you. You know, the last time I did an early morning stream about IRL streamers, it was Ice Poseidon, back when Corrine was stealing iPads. Oh, I know what the truth is, Corrine. You stole that man's iPad and tried to lie about it. We know the truth. And here I am once again, nearly around the exact same time, very early in the morning for me at least, talking about a live stream that turned out disastrously. Or as I like to call it, when keeping it real goes wrong. That's totally my original saying. I didn't get it from anywhere. I'm very smart. I came up with that on my own. For those of you unaware, I'll give you a little backstory here. Andy Worski is a in real life streamer. It means he goes out into the public with a software program called Text to Speech, TTS, in which where you give him money will play through a speaker. So anything your creative little mind can come up with will be played for the public. Apparently, a few super chats uh, created a little bit of tension, leading in an <laughs> leading to an arrest this evening or this morning, uh, more accurately. And we're going to be reviewing the footage. It's about a half an hour. This won't be an extremely long stream, but I think it's uh, a good to look at and just watch uh, what not to do in this situation. And it looks bad. It looks really, really, really fucking bad, guys. I'm not sure how it's going to turn out, uh, what the end result is going to be. But um, oof. if a DA, if a prosecutor watches this stream and really listens to the audio, it is not going to be a good time uh, for these gentlemen. So let me get the stream set up. Let me get it ready. I'll put it up at the, the time code uh, that I've been told is where it all begins. And we'll watch it through. We'll see what happens. We'll see this escalation, this confrontation between these different individuals that led up to uh, a gun being drawn. Super chats leading up to gunfire. Who doesn't love a story like that? <laughs> what the fuck were you guys thinking? What in the fucking ever-loving fuck did you... <laughs> it's amazing to me. Just, just brilliant. All right. I think I've got it queued up. Let me put that chat away. Get this widescreen. And we're going to just, we're going to watch an implosion in real time here. Of terrible life decisions all adding up to a very bad result for one individual by the name of Alex. Poor Alex. Can I get an F in chat for Alex? He's sitting in lockup right now, probably having a real bad night. Real, real bad day. It's a Sunday, so I don't think he's going to be getting out for a little while. He's going to be sitting in lockup for a while. No bail for you, buddy. Enjoy your new cellmate, Tyrone. Let's get an F for him. Poor, poor little Alex. Okay. I think we are set up. We are we are ready to go. We are ready to take a look at this. Um, now, I might cut from the video that's going to be playing through YouTube, and I might actually take a piece of it, and I might play it through another program to try to up the audio a little bit, because uh, there's specific things that are said that really need to be listened to. Uh, I haven't watched all of it. We're going to bounce around, but from what I understand, this is where it begins, when they come across a gentleman on the street. So let's uh, let's start her up. One year ago, one year ago, we did a few months ago, they throw hand grenades around in Sweden. Uh -huh. You got a black guy walking around saying, fuck the white boys. Come on, that's what you Oh, I've heard it before. Hey, it don't matter though, man. Come on. Already, we're off to a good start. A little physical confrontation. Uh, can you guess what the super chat was that upset that uh, uh, hulking individual of testosterone? Slap that camera right out of your fucking hand. Oh, he seemed, a, he seemed a little bit upset. No, we'll back that up just a tiny bit. Uh, this is apparently where it begins. So let's, uh, uh, no, no, a little, little bit back. Right off, already off to an amazing start. There's a war against white men. Yes, well, not, no. No, you know, not really, no. no. We're not involved. I'll be honest with you, man. 
That's true. One year ago, one year ago, one year ago, six months ago, they throw hand grenades around in Sweden. Uh -huh. You got a black guy walking around saying, fuck the white boys. Come on, man. Oh, I've heard it before. Hey, it don't matter, though, no, man. Come on. Guys what the fuck are you? Don't don't touch the fucking phone, bro. Yo, keep walking, bro. The fuck are you? What's wrong with you, man? I love how Andy Worski, little Andy Worski, the dude that's built like a broomstick, is gonna tell that manlet that looks like a brick house, just keep walking. Hey, Alpha Chad, the guy whose bicep is the size of my head. Why don't you walk away before I hurt you? I don't know if you're aware of this, but I've trained in MMA. And I will use my Canadian Kung Fu to bitch smack you across the street. Oh, I may only weigh 80 pounds soaking wet, but you are fucking with the thunder. So you're going to hit someone? You're going to fucking hit someone? Get the fuck out of here. You shit. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Go, 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 walk. Walk, bro. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here! Keep walking! Fucking piece of shit! Fucking knock you out, bro! Yo, fuck. I will totally kick your ass as I walk away. You don't know how lucky you are that I'm walking in the opposite direction because it's it's a world of hurt coming at you. As you see me, as you see me walk in the opposite direction, you don't want to fuck with these hands, boy. These are lethal weapons. I had to go through at least five security checks getting into this country. Because when they saw these hands, they knew I was a dangerous motherfucker. You're lucky that I've decided to walk backwards telling you how lucky you are. Fucking get out of here. You want Nazi Germany? Go to fucking walk. China. Get the fuck out of here. Go to China. Yeah, yeah. You want to fucking go? Get the fuck. Walk right now. Walk right now, you fuck. You want me to call the cops? Yeah? You hit my fucking property! Me. You fucking assaulted me! No, you fucking assaulted me! He assaulted him! He fucking assaulted me! Walk, you do this shit! No, I'm fucking racist! Walk! Free speech is racist! Walk, motherfucker! Keep watching CNN, pal! Fucking cunt! Fucking knock you out, bro! Get the fuck out of here! Rachel Maddow will have you on the show! Thank you, thank you, brother! Be the shit. Oh, oh. oh, yeah, he's gonna walk now. He's gonna walk here. He's a social justice warrior. He's That's the equivalent of that guy that says you're go, a go. Like that. Walk! Walk! I don't know if when you're in a physical confrontation, telling the other dude to walk away and then walking after him is the smartest follow up to that. Dude, you'd better walk the other direction or we're gonna have violence. Oh, you're walking away? Let me follow you. And tell you how lucky you are. I'm not kicking your ass. <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't think it works like that. Buddy, you want to knock me out? I call the cops on you, motherfucker. Get out of here. <laughs> Fucking faggot. <laughs> Fucking faggot. Put it back in the. Put it back in the thing. Hold this. Hold, hold, hold something. Yeah. Hold speaker. <laughs> yeah, you want to fucking see? Can you imagine? I, this uh, This applies to any in real life streamer, by the way, not just Andy, but any streamer. Have you ever seen those little sticks they have? I want you, I want you to imagine. And they're always really tiny dudes. I want, like Ice Poseidon's a very skinny dude. Andy's kind of a skinny dude. I want you to imagine some guy with a fucking 14 foot long selfie pole and his iPhone at the end of it, just spinning around in a circle talking about how he's going to destroy you as <laughs> he's reading chat. I'm going to fucking, I'm going to tear you apart. Let me get another angle on this. Move my selfie stick a little bit. I'm going to rotate it. Get some cinematic uh, angles going on here. You're a fucking dead man. You are a dead man, my friend. <laughs> motherfucker. Hit my fucking phone on the floor, motherfucker. No, but you assaulted me. You assaulted me. I know, but you know what? Remember, you're a white man. This sounds, this sounds like the Owen Schroyer sketch. Yeah, I know, yeah. You're a fucking white male. Yeah, go, go. That's brilliant. Okay, so we're going to analyze this tape as it goes from the initial encounter all the way up until the arrest. So what do we have so far? We've got a group of guys that come up to them. They're drunk. They're angry. Racist super chats. That's their claim. 
gets physical, assaults them. That's I mean, that is correct. There's no denying it. Knocks the camera out of his hand. Boom. You know, there you go. Now, these guys are walking away. I mean, they're already, I don't know if you can see my mouse on screen, but they're like at least a half a block to uh, three quarters of a block away at this point. And out comes the taser. So uh, the, it's not de-escalating the situation. It's, we're going to fuck you up, zap, zap, zap. He's like Sonichu. Alex is he's, he's doing his fucking Sonichu impression with his fucking taser. Listen to that thing. I know, but you know what? Remember, you're a white male. This sounds this looks like the Owen Schroyer sketch. Yeah, I know. Yeah. You're a fucking white male. Yeah, go, go. You want the electricity, buddy? Oh, I'm going to shock you good. Oh, there's going to be so many volts of vengeance going through your soy boy ass. You're not, I'm going to own the libs. I'm going to own the libs with at least 800 volts. Oh, oh, it's a thundering is coming. Literally calling down the lightning. Here comes the thunder. He's got his little zapper ready. I, I don't know if that really is intimidating, I'll be honest with you. If you're squaring up against somebody and their first instinct is to grab a taser rather than put their hands up, probably means they're not good at throwing punches. Be the shit. That's one thing we got, motherfucker. Where's the car? Where's the car? All right, let's walk to our car. Fucking. Let's walk to our car behind the guys that just left. The dudes that wanted to physically fight us and got physical with us after we told them we were going to zap to the extreme and electrocute them. Let's start following them down the street because they're going to know we're headed towards our car. <laughs> it's just one bad decision after another. It's great. Hey, we're going back to our car. We're going to our car. Don't we're going back to our car. Look, we're going Stay away from us. Stay with me. Stay with me. Okay, so this guy's got a ripped shirt. When did that happen? Now, maybe there was something that happened before the initial uh, confrontation. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe his muscles are so bulging that he's pulled a Hulk Hogan. It's literally, he's tearing his shirt apart. He can't contain the powerhouse that's behind this white t-shirt. I'm not, that or he's a hobo. He's a hobo that sleeps on the street. One of the two. Stay away from me. Stay away. You're walking towards me. Back off. You will? Go ahead. Back off, sir. Back off. Back the fuck off. What was that hand gesture failure? <laughs> what were you doing there? It looked like he was trying to do sign language. He, it looked like a dude doing sign language who had a spastic attack. Let's You're watch that again. Watch. Let's wait for it. Wait, watch his hands. <laughs> it's, it's, oh, wait, here it comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. Wait, wait. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, do it. Do it. Here's the handicap sign language. What is that? You're going down, motherfucker. I'm going to put you six feet under. <laughs> Guy, you want to knock the fuck out? The fuck Back off. Back off. You're ready to Fuck you. Oh, he tased him. All right, we got the first tasing happened in front of the security guards who probably don't want to deal with any of this shit. Guy, get away. You want to get away, right? Hit me with it, motherfucker. Get away. Alex, 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 go, Alex, now. Get the fuck back! Get the fuck back! Yeah, this is this is going to be fantastic. By the way, this goes on for another twenty-five minutes, leading up until the conclusion. So it's it's got it's got action and drama. It's got it all. It's fantastic. I know. I was muted. I got so excited with the taser that I accidentally muted myself. I needed to soak it in. It's not every day you see somebody tase another dude, and it has zero effect on him. I'm serious. Get the fuck back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get the fuck out of here. Fuck back. Andy, let's go. I uh, that's that is some high IQ liberal thought right there. You racist motherfuckers, go back to where you came from. <laughs> How does that work? 
You, you fucking racist watermelon eaters. Go back over to the fence, gardener. I hate you racist. You violent racist. Fucking piece of shit. Let's fucking go. kick this guy's fucking ass. Let's, let's go, dude. You're lucky you're not fucking on the ground bleeding, you faggot. No. You're so lucky, bro, that I am again walking away and not getting into a physical confrontation with you because I am the living incarnation of an ass whooping. Made physical. Come down to earth from the high heavens to lay a smackdown upon you. Oh, nice packs! Gonna work with a fucking bullet in them! Okay, well, here's where our trouble begins, and you'll understand why as we go along. Just remember this. After their confrontation and the guys walk away, they follow after them, get into a second confrontation where they tase them. Now as they're walking away, Alex says, you want to get shot, and Andy follows it up with his little line about a bullet wound in his abs. Screaming faggot, you want to get shot, you want to get shot, uh, how are you going to look with a bullet in you? Just remember that as we go ahead. Fucking faggot. Fuck that guy's Kill him. I'm going to kill them. I'm going to kill them. Just again, keep these in mind. Keep these little nuggets of uh, sound bites in mind. <laughs> because I'm sure the fucking DA will. You think, you think it was a super chat like that that escalated this evening? <laughs> you think somebody got really upset about that particular super chat was what started it? I fucking jump, motherfucker. I love how a Anthony, uh, bro, <laughs> let me just, is your hair purple? <laughs> like you're, I think this is like a gay pride event. There's some weird shit happening in Clearwater. I don't know where he is. Uh, earlier in the stream, they were like talking to some very uh, interesting individuals. <laughs> but it's not super intimidating when your hair is pure purple. And you're like, I'm going to fucking murder that guy. Oh, he's a dead man. When the time comes down to it, I will fucking... Own you! Don't fuck with me! Now you think this is where it ends. You get into some weird confrontation out on the streets. It's like 3 in the morning. It's 4 in the morning. Whatever. People are drunk. They're upset. You, know, you get your camera smacked. You tase a dude. Call each other faggots. Threaten to kill each other. And you walk your separate ways. And that's where it's going to end. But no, actually it's going to continue onward. Leading up until probably the most remarkable moment you'll ever see in in real life streaming. In fact, I would say it is quintessentially IRL streaming. The definition of IRL streaming <laughs> We're getting there. Uh, yeah. Here, hold up. Yeah, just chill, Andy. I'm chill. I'm chill. Yeah. I'm gonna fucking fight the guy. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Show the days of the security guard. See... He just nodded to me. He's like, yeah, yeah. go ahead. I just didn't see the fucking dude come for the fucking phone. No, I didn't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 400 experience points. Which way? Here, hold up. Guys, sorry, fuck my mind. mind. <laughs> this reminds me of um, he's kind of he's a little he's a little off kilter, you know. He's a little spooked from the encounter. It reminds me of when Baked Alaska lost his Twitter account. There's this video where Baked Alaska goes into like a fast food restaurant's parking lot, and he doesn't know really where to go, so it's just him spinning in circles and walking around with his selfie stick pointed out. 
I kind of remember Andy's a little flustered. He's, he's all over the place. Where do, where, where do I go? I want to fuck these guys up so bad. Sorry. He's taking his shirt off like he wants to fuck me in the ass. I'll kill him. Because <laughs> you're happy about this, you ruined one of his shirts, Andy. Yeah. Good. Fucking piece of shit. Should have fucking tased his ass. <laughs> well, he tried to, but uh, I did, but I think it's a fucking piece of junk. Yeah. Okay, so we got confirmation he did make contact. He literally tased the dude and it had no effect. I did tase him, but it's a piece of crap. So <laughs> I'm guessing that guy is real liquored up or that's the world's cheapest taser. Maybe running on Duracell batteries. Yeah. Well, I wait. Okay, relax. L1 and R1, y'all. <laughs> Run away. Where's the car? It's in here, right? Where's that? You have to go around. Uh, around? Yeah. I wish something else was fucking ripped. I wish his fucking face was ripped. Anyway, how are you all doing tonight? <laughs> now, I believe they wander around for a little bit. They go back, they talk to the acoustic guitar player. That's fine. They're, they go back to the very uh, the general vicinity of where they were before. So, we're going to skip ahead a little bit uh, to when things get even more entertaining. Uh, right about here. And uh, this is where our fun begins. Again, like I said, kind of a short stream. But I want you to see, that was the beginning of what happened. And I want you to see what happens now. So prepare yourselves. It's uh, it's a nice little snapshot of in real life streaming. Here we go. Walk or come. That has to be a t-shirt. <laughs> what did the thing say? I didn't hear anything. I didn't uh, see anything. Andy, please pay this soft. Oh, that was already. No, I don't know. Did you swear? If you swore, I can't read. he's shaking the if, camera too much. If you swore, and, yeah. What did he say? Uh. Walk or come. Uh, Chad or Chad or bad. Um, K. I don't know why I didn't read. Sorry. Chad's a bad. Um, K. K. We can wrap it up already. So. Yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Purple Dragon. Fun night. Epic ending. Oh, he didn't know how prescient that statement was. Epic ending. Oh, you're gonna get an epic ending. It's coming in literally one minute, Andy. <laughs> he definitely knows how to end a stream on a bang. Um, down in the fucking garage before we leave. Yeah, we're gonna fucking eat Wait, the fuck. We really didn't think anything was gonna happen tonight. We had shitty connections to start. Yeah, out. we thought we were gonna have to go home without anything. And it'll be a great night. Yeah. A lot of funny moments. Talked to a lot of cool people. Holy shit, I never realized how short Alex is. Look at that. We need to crowdfund this man a pair of stilts so we can see him on camera. Above the neck, below the neck, I mean. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Is that your son? Yeah. Hey, it's like one in the morning and we're starving. That's what happens. They want us to still go, though. I'm glad we're not hurt either. Us to go? Where, where do we go? Every, everything's... We need to start why don't we just, in the day. Yeah, why don't we just eat at, like, a, still warm. Why don't we just eat at the fucking like, water and just talk with the, the yeah. audience right, for a bit? The water right over there. All you have to ask is, yeah, it's out of the water and we'll eat. Cause we, uh, honestly, too, you know, you know what it feels cool with the chat watching. It feels like we got like 170 people I like, have our back. Yeah, I'm not that hungry anymore, so I'll hold the camera. I'm actually very, very hungry. But you, is that him? Is that him? Oh, God damn. That's him. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna break this down and watch it a few times. I want you to remember initial confrontation. That group of uh, drunk individuals. I uh, got physical with Andy and his group, slapped the camera out of his hand. They walked away. That was the end of the first confrontation. Second confrontation, Andy Failure and Alex walking down the same route that the group that left walked. They again get physical, and Alex tases him. Now this is the third confrontation happening at the end of the stream. Now Alex just said, let's just walk away. All right, keep that in mind. Let's go. Let's just fucking walk away from this situation. That's him. Keep going. We don't have anyone around here. Oh. Uh yeah, see, keep going. We don't have anybody around here. Let's just get the fuck out of here. All right, let's watch. But, yeah. They're coming towards us. So let's walk away. But. Again, uh, there's failure. They're coming towards us, and Alex for the third time clearly states, let's walk away. Pro <laughs> Spoiler alert, doesn't happen. 
Alright, yo. Stand your ground. All right, stand your ground. Here he is. And this is where I think there's going to be some legal issues. Alright. They decide to stand their ground. That's what failure's saying. Alex wants to walk away. Failure's saying, no, no, stand your ground. Now, just watch what happens. I, I, I played a few times once without any commentary, but it's just it, it's really important of how this looks when you see this situation. That group of guys may be walking towards them, but they're a good deal away. Now, Failure and Andy, uh, I, I'm going to assume, understand that Alex owns and has a gun on him. And they start talking about stand your ground. They're in Florida. Stand your ground, sir. Stay back! Stay back! Andy, grab the fucking speaker! Stay back, stay back. Go aim, aim, aim. All right, here Alex is pulling his gun out. Andy's encouraging him to aim the gun. Now, I want you to understand, when you're trying to set up a case, this is my layman's opinion. Maybe uh, Nick Riccato will comment later on and tell me how wrong I am. But if you're trying to claim a self-defense situation, I don't think that you can close the gap to initiate that self-defense. And that's what you're going to see failure do. He already starts saying, stand your ground. Alex pulls out his gun, and he starts saying, aim. Now watch what failure does. Aim. Stay back, guys. Go, Alex. All right. Uh, Alex, or uh, failure's about to get his ass kicked, but... Failure walked towards them and started saying, it's almost like a cliche, uh, don't approach me, sir, I feel threatened. Almost like he's trying to set up justification for Alex to shoot these guys. This is where I think their biggest legal problems are going to occur. They know Alex has a gun. They could have walked away. Alex said, let's walk away. They said, no, 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 let's not. And he's encouraging him to get his gun out and aim it. Failure is encouraging him to get his gun out. Failure goes up to these guys and confronts them. And then tries to use a, a phrase, a legal phrase, to justify somebody taking action on his behalf. I feel threatened. Now, I, I put this in an audio amplifier, in a, like an editing program. I'm almost 100% certain that after they punched failure, he started screaming, shoot. Let's back that up just a little bit and watch it again. Listen really carefully to what failure says. Uh, I'll, I'll pull it up in a different program in a minute. Stand, stand your ground. Here, here he is. Stand your ground. Stay back. Stay back. Andy, grab the fucking what? speaker. Stay back. Stay back. Go aim, 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 aim. Stay back, guys. Go, Alex. You hear that twice he screamed it. Shoot, shoot, as he as he ran the opposite direction. He knows Alex has a gun. We've got our, our, our justification in their minds for shooting these people. Stay back, stay back, stay back. Stay back. You can hear it there clearly again. Look, here's Failure. The other guy is off screen. He's at least 10 feet away from him. And Failure, again, as Alex has his gun drawn, screams, shoot. Stay back. Stay! Back! Stay back! Stay the fuck back! Stay back! Stay the fuck back! Walk away now! Stay back! Stay back! Get the fuck back! <laughs> Andy, what happened? <laughs> Just 20 minutes earlier, you're talking about how you were gonna powerhouse these motherfuckers. Oh, I'm gonna destroy him. I, you're so lucky. I'm walking the other way, dude. No, no, you sound like a hysterical woman. What the fuck? Stay back! <laughs> Andy, what are you doing, bro? Get the yeah. fuck back! Get back! Get back! Get back! I love... This, this entire segment is... This is the definition of in real life streaming. Where else can you see a gunfight in the street and a super chat pop up starting to scream, I hate knickers? Stay the fuck back! Walk away now! Stay back! Stay back! Get the fuck back! Get the fuck back! Get back! Get back! Get back! Get the fuck back! He was assaulted! Get the fuck back! We hate Nick. Get the fuck back! Aim, 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 aim! Andy, aim, aim! Pull your gun out again and shoot them! 
This man has offended me. <laughs> put the put the speaker down, Alex, and deliver justice. Name the cops now. Name. Stay the fuck back. Stay back. We will defend ourselves. We will defend ourselves. We will defend ourselves. Stay the fuck back. You know what the funniest part of this is? When he pulled his gun, they were all going to walk away. But the moment they heard Andy's voice filled with pure terror, they actually reconsidered their options and thought, maybe we can take them still. <laughs> Andy was so non-threatening that even with a gun pointed at them, once they heard him start screaming to stay back, they actually considered, maybe we can win this. I mean, sure, one of them's got a gun, but I think we can take that skinny Canadian. <laughs> I think we can fuck him up. Stay the fuck back! Stay the fuck back! We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! Do you hear us? We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! You go to fucking jail! You will defend ourselves! You're on camera! You're on camera! Stay back! Stay back! Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out, pull it out! I, <laughs> I want to take that audio and edit it into other things. Especially after that clip of Andy and Alex from like a week ago. Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out, pull it out. Come on, Alex, whip that big boy out. I want to see that big black gun you got, Alex. Whip it out on the street and impress the kids. Come on, Alex, just just pull that puppy out. Show this guy what you're packing. Stay the fuck back! You want to get shot? Stay back! You get shot! You get shot! You get shot! Stand the fuck back! Andy, do not approach. Yeah, okay, you know what? Actually, I don't want to interrupt this audio, but just listen, all right? Again, you've got a gun pulled uh, on these guys, right? You know, you're like, I'm going to shoot if you don't back off. And Andy starts fucking following them with the camera. You can't pull a gun on motherfuckers and be like, you need to back up and then start pursuing them in the street. Back! You want to get shot? Stay back! You get shot! You get shot! You get shot! Stand the fuck back! They're walking away. Andy, do not approach them. Failure walk away. Hey, 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 get away from them now. Buddy, go. Get away aim, from aim, them. aim, aim, aim. Buddy, you're getting shot. You're going to get shot. You're going to get shot. You're going to get shot. Walk away. 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 Hold this, hold this. Do not approach them. They're walking away now. Get away. Hey, 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 go, go. All right, they're leaving. Fuck that. Follow them, follow Are you fucking mental? Really? What the fuck are you idiots thinking? You know, I, I we'll get to the end result of this because there's a lot more. But Alex is the one that gets fucked over this. All right. Alex is the one that wanted to walk away during the initial confrontation. He didn't want to pull out his fucking gun. These two dumbasses get him to pull his fucking gun out. Then they get him into a standoff with strangers in the fucking street. They keep telling him, walk away. And when they finally start to walk away, they pursue them and they're like, no, they're fleeing the scene. Fuck that. And they want to follow them. Absolute stupidity of this is fucking mind boggling. Follow them, follow them, follow them, follow them. Go to jail. It's on camera. It's on camera. You want you up towards me? No! Stay back! Yeah, again, that's not how you de-escalate a situation, is it? You can't pull a gun on a motherfucker and tell him to go away or you're going to kill him and then start following him down the street. Of course he's going to fucking get angry and try to continue. Stay back! Yeah! We hate you, please. Stop, guys. Stop. We not, you, not the fucking we time. Fuck case. off. We I love you, chat, by the way, for doing that. I love the fact that IRL streamers, uh, fan bases, and viewers don't give a shit. <laughs> you could be in the middle of the world's worst situation, and they will still pop a super chat up just to escalate it a little bit more. Oh, is Andy in the group in the middle of a, a confrontation with people that think they're racist? Let me just super chat we hate knickers <laughs> in the middle of a gun battle a second time. Fuck them. Use this feature. Please make sure you hate Nikkei. Stop, stop, you fucking retard. We hate Nikkei. Turn that shit off. It's not the fucking oh. time. Oh. 
Stay back! Stay back! Stay back! Stay back! Stay back! Yeah, see, again, like, when you're looking at the initial, when he pulls the gun out, it just, it, and I'm not saying this is what they're doing, I'm just saying, looking at it, that's how it appears. Like, you know your guy's got a gun. You're walking up to him and being like, I feel threatened, I feel threatened. You know, in fact, this is, I'll show you what, exactly what this reminds me of. It reminds me of something very specifically, uh, what they're doing right now. Because uh, that's the second time he's done it. They pursue them, get them aggravated, they come at him, and they're like, he's coming towards me, he's coming right at me. Uh, which is, <laughs> it reminds me completely of this. Uh, here we go. Boys, looky there. That there's a Rocky Mountain black bear. One of the few remaining of its kind. Isn't it beautiful? My God, it's coming right for us! Uh, you see, boys, the Democrats have passed a lot of laws trying to stop us from hunting. Democrats piss me off. They say we can't shoot certain animals anymore unless they're posing an immediate threat. Therefore, before we shoot something, we have to say, it's coming right for us. That is that is exactly what they were trying to do this evening. <laughs> they were trying to South Park those guys. <laughs> with their stand their ground thing. Or that one with um, Token and Cartman where he draws a little circle in the street and shoots them. It feels like that too. Oh, what the fuck were you guys thinking? Don't approach my body! Do not approach my body! These guys just assaulted my friend! We're following! The police will be here in a second, you fuck! Yeah? He assaulted our friend! He's gonna assault my friend! Yeah! Failure! Failure! You know, they're real fucking lucky. Andy, if you're listening to this, you were so fucking lucky those guys didn't have guns themselves. Like, you pulled a weapon on them. And then when they tried to walk away, you could have let the police handle it. You fucking followed them down the street. If they had a gun, they would have been justified in pulling it out and killing you. Well, you want to talk about self-defense, you're stalking them down the street with a pistol. They could have claimed they're coming right for us, which you technically were in this situation with a loaded weapon, or what they'd assume is a loaded weapon. If those guys had concealed carry, if they had a gun on them, they could have shot you, they could have shot Failure, they could have shot Alex. Incredibly fucking stupid. You fucking made the wrong move. What, you'll kill him? Hey, I got the on camera, buddy. We were, we were leaving, we were going to our car and you followed us. These guys threaten us right now to kill us. Always a good way to greet the officer. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm armed. They're just drunk. I'm the one with the gun and everybody else is drunk. How are you doing, officer? How's your evening treating you? We're getting arrested. They they assaulted my friend. They're gonna get away. They're not going anywhere. They're not going anywhere. They're not going anywhere. The clear water is running on aviation. I'm with the security guard right now. No, I I'm just with you. The old security guard actually has to tell them to stop spazzing out. Could you, Spurgs, control your tard rage this morning? I don't want to have to clean the sidewalk up in front of the building I work at of blood because you idiots can't calm down. Just just try to tone it down a little bit. These guys are under security. Uh, Getting arrested. They're walking towards the My buddy used restraint. You're staying right there, okay? Uh, are, I'm with the guys that were assaulted. Yeah. Um, uh, we're staying here with the security guard, uh, the guys who assaulted us. I hear they come. I uh, hear. Walking towards the huh? I, I don't know. It's a. Uh, what? Uh, yes, I agree, Chad. People are like the old man. We like the old man. <laughs> he just walks up to them. Could you, Nancy's, put down your guns? I'll go deal with the big tough guys. Just control yourselves. Get get some toilet paper for the little Canadian girl. 
so he can he can wall up his vagina and not get blood on our beautiful sidewalks. What, what are you armed with? It's a Walford PPQ. So Walford PPQ, and he has it It's completely uh, disarmed. Yeah. There's no magazines in it. I'm sorry, did you hear that as well? Uh, I don't do security yeah. follow on them. Okay, yeah, my gun's put away, the magazine's out. What? Thank you, sir. Appreciate, appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You guys be safe. Everything's good. There, there, please have them, please have them. Please have them. Please have them. Alright, we've got them. Thank you. Alright, we've got them. Thank you very much. Alright, good. Uh, fun fact of the evening. Uh, I don't think those gentlemen get arrested. But <laughs> somebody else does. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, stay here. They got him right up there. Stay here. Let's just stay here. I'll put this down. Uh, somebody in chat saying uh, their defense is going to be that the gun wasn't loaded. I I don't even know if that's going to work. It it doesn't matter to the the perception of the other group. It, it, that's what's important. Oh, the gun wasn't loaded. Well, they don't fucking know that. All they know is some random dude on the street pulled a gun out on them. I don't know. It just it looks incredibly bad. You know, you've got one guy saying, "Let's just walk away. Let's walk away from the situation." And I'm not saying they need to get their asses beat, but, you know, to go forward and be like, oh my God, I'm in danger, please don't hurt me, I fear for my life, as your friend's pulling his gun out and the other guy's screaming, shoot, 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 and aim, 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 aim. It makes, like, I, I could tell you how this is going to get spun, Andy, if you're watching this. I can tell you exactly the spin that's going to be on this when Holt or whoever the fuck it is writes an article about it. Uh, super racist alt-writer Canadian Andy Race Worski attempts uh, to get a man shot on stream for money. That's how he's going to spin it. He's going to make it look like you guys tried to set up a, a bullshit self-defense shooting to try to get super chats. I mean, that's that's going to be the fucking story on this. I don't I don't understand what the fuck happened. Why are you walking around with a pistol and a taser? Why, why are you streaming with a pistol and a taser? I'm going to charge Yeah, no. I'm, they hit me in the back of the head. I know, I saw it. I filmed it. it like it doesn't... I, I, have it, I have it on film. I have it all on film. All on film, and then I ran up. And I told him to aim. Hands mm -hmm. up. Just put him up on the... Alright. Put hands up. Oh, you I wish Super Chat was still on. If I had been watching this and they had Super Chat on when they when the cops were approaching them, I would have start, <laughs> started hands up, don't shoot. That would have been my that would have been my uh, cherry pick comment. I don't need him up. Just put him here on the rail. Like this. Right. Hey, George, just stay here. Yeah, alright. Put your arms on the rail. You don't need to put them up in there like you're a criminal. <sighs> yeah, that's sage advice. Call the police, tell me you have a, a gun that you drew on somebody. But then don't put your hands up. Only reason you'd put your only reason you'd show the cops your hands after telling them you have a loaded firearm is if you're a criminal. Instead, keep them in your pockets. That puts the police officer's mind at rest. Oh, that gentleman's relaxed. He has his hands in his pockets with a loaded gun. <laughs> what are you doing? Do me a favor and mute that. Just mute it. Okay, I'm going to mute it for a sec, guys. Now, what do you think they're mumbling to each other while they've muted the stream? <laughs> do you think it's just repeating, we're fucked, we're fucked, we're fucked? Don't tell them anything, boys. <laughs> Only 100 people saw this on stream. Oh, I hear the cops come. Why is this metrosexual Canadian man? <laughs> Why is he holding a camera at us? <laughs> Super chat, can you imagine if the phone volume's still on? We have a gun? <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh, our boy's getting arrested. Oh, Alex, 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 what a night for you. Oh, poor little guy. It wasn't even his fault. He didn't do any of this shit. Alex just wanted to walk the fuck away. He, he didn't want any part of this shit. <laughs> Fucking Andy and failure's big brain plan. Get some landed in the clink. And it's a weekend. I don't know, uh, you know, how it is in Florida, but my understanding, pretty much all around the country, if you're in on a Saturday or Sunday, you're fucked. You're, you're not getting out until uh, the weekday. So he's going to sit in jail for a day because these two big-brained individuals wanted to stand their ground in Florida. Just brilliant. They look fucked up. I mean, Alex looks more calm and collected than those two, and he's the one that's getting arrested. He's the one that had a gun drawn on people. 
Alex and Failure look like they're going to cry. Yes, Chad, I am, I'm reading uh, You're Going to Jail might be a conversation that's going through. Uh, F and chat for Alex, uh, that's another one. I hear the confrontation with the police officers entertaining as well. I hear that uh, the cop calls him stupid, basically. <laughs> so we're going to take a look and see how that goes. We'll, we'll watch this play itself out a little bit. Wait for the uh, audio to come back on. I'm going to pop it ahead a little bit see if we got it here. All right, here we go. Yeah, yeah. We were walking from two tens over. We were, wa we were in front of a bar from two cans. There was a guy. Uh, it's the one. It's sort of like the one that was inside of the parking lot. There. I like how the cop literally waves him off. Alex is the one getting arrested, and the cop holds his hand up and he's like, Be quiet, child. I'm talking to your guardian. Maybe the cop is confused by Alex's height and thinks it's a kid. Hush, son. I need to speak to an adult to find out what happened this evening. I love that look. That look on his face. <laughs> this look on his face. This is... This, kids, is the end result of in-real-life streaming. There you go. That's the look you get on your face when you in-real-life stream. Well, my buddy's going to prison. <sighs> what am I going to do tomorrow? <laughs> what granted? Am I going to go to Disney World? Maybe I'll go to the Astrodome. <laughs> what, are, what are my plans for the next stream? Oh, his smile and optimism gone. So exuberant earlier on. So happy to start out the stream. And it ends, it ends with a face like that. <laughs> He's not even the one going to jail. He assaulted him and he was coming fire violently. Right I did not Nobody point it at him. I did not point it at him. Again? Yeah. No. Well, thanks for the evidence. Holy shit, the fucking phone is still going. The super chats are still going. We have a gun and we'll shoot you. Blue lives don't matter. Holy shit, Andy, turn it off. I pointed it at... What do you mean? Oh. I put it in evidence. Yeah, it's a live stream. It's a live stream. It's live. We have 180 people watching it live. I was on the phone with the cops the whole time. Pointing gun at somebody down the street. He was running up towards us. Stop talking. I was making sure no one got hurt. I was I was making sure nobody got hurt. Oh my God! Look at the look on his face. Look at Alex's face. Holy shit! Do you think it finally hit him? I'm going to jail because Andy Worski is a dumbass? <laughs> oh, dude! Oh, what a fucking shitty weekend. This guy, what do you, all right. I'm not, Let's get him down there towards the car and get a cruiser. We can get him in, we'll get everybody separated, and we'll go. Can I get our cell phone? Yeah, you can tell it down there. Go. Okay. Uh, Andy, if there's bail, you gotta get that immediately. Yep, no problem. Uh, Andy, don't don't forget about me. Remember your friend Alex, the guy that's going to sing sing because of your stupid big brained ideas. For the love of fuck, for the love of fuck, Andy, don't let me rot in prison. <laughs> Look at his face. Uh, uh, best of luck, Alex. You know, uh, shit happens sometimes. To make an omelet, buddy. You got to break some eggs. Unfortunately, tonight, Alex, you were the egg. <laughs> don't worry though. Uh, you know, we'll we'll have fun at Disney World without you. Think of you, champ. We'll send you a postcard. I can't do that on my finger. No problem. No problem. See, from what I see here, it's a bunch of guys who are worried they might get in a fight and then they pull a gun on somebody. Uh, they were I, I, I know, but you don't pull a gun on somebody because they want to fight you. No, sir. Uh, they don't sir. have any weapons. Sir. I love the way this cop, basically what the cop is telling him. I mean, he's not technically 100% correct on this, but he, he basically what the cop is telling these guys right now is, you are all a bunch of giant fucking pussies. You are a bunch of walking, living, talking, breathing vaginas. These guys wanted to fight you in the street. You could have squared up. You could have taken your licks and given some. Instead, you little Nancys, you pulled out a gun.
and now I've got to deal with this shit on my Sunday morning. You disgust me. That's what that cop is really saying to them right now. He's just saying it in a very subtle way. Yes, sir, um, may I just explain the story from my point of view? If that, that's fine. You can say whatever you want. All right, cool. So basically, we already uh, de-escalated confrontation down the street. And they followed us with two new, uh, the, well, the dude in the white shirt followed us. The cop isn't even listening to him right now. He's on his Instagram. He's on his Instagram account posting a picture saying, you would not believe what I'm dealing with this evening. There's this Canadian dude, and he's a streamer, and he pulled a gun on some guy that threw a punch. Do you believe that shit? I'm telling you, being a cop sucks. With those two new guys in the yellow shirts, and they were coming up towards us. They ended up heading towards him, punching him in the back of the head, and walking towards uh, Alex and I. So Alex, we warned them, stay back, stay back, stay back. They wouldn't stay back. So Alex, he, he pulled out his gun, and, and then, then they stopped. Then we phoned the police, and this is the situation we're in right now. But they were walking toward us while we were asking them to, to, to step back. Yellow, huh? There was two guys on me. And they're already previously just... <laughs> Dude, this cop doesn't give a shit. Oh, you don't understand. There were two guys on me. Looks at him. Yeah, but there are three of you. <laughs> He's just... The dude's just calling them pussies to their faces. You don't pull a gun on them. You smell that, boys? Smells like bitch to me, and it's wafting over from your general direction. Maybe you need to learn to take a punch, pussies. Yeah, but, no, no, but they had separated him. You ever put the camera down and think to help out your body? Or I did, place? I did. You ever think to put the camera down? Andy, this guy is tearing into you. Hey, little girl, little Susie Q with the purple hair. Did you ever think to put the camera down, stop collecting those super berries, and be a man for a minute? Maybe help your buddy out who's getting his shit kicked in the street? Guess not. I'm going to have to write you a ticket for being a vagina. When that happened, when I saw the swing, I went up to him. And then your buddy pulled out a gun and pointed at everybody. It's he was, on here. It's on the video. And they're running towards us. So what do we do? I got to do it just like... <laughs> the cop actually laughs at him. <laughs> he knows. This cop knows they're trying the South Park defense. Allow them to attack us? I'm not sure how we defend ourselves. We told them to stay back or we have to defend ourselves. Mm -hmm. And they followed us too, so. All that time they were following you, you never called the cops. Hang on, you know, I just want to say, hey, hey, if I, I think we should get a lawyer. Hey. Oh, it finally, it finally clicks in. I think we should get a lawyer, really? <laughs> Here's some sound advice for anybody that ever finds himself in a, in a situation. Be cordial, of course. You, you, you know, be you know, nice, casual conversation. But don't give details on anything. Just give factual information. My name is. Uh, we call the police. And there you go. Just give, give quick bullet point facts. Don't start explaining yourself. Because that's going to end in a cop calling you a pussy. What are we talking you about? Walk over there to him again and we'll put you in. Come stand over here. All right. I've explained my side of the story. That's it. Why isn't he being assaulted not a concern right now? Uh, that's not what it is. I got assaulted though. I got you in the back of the head. But but team listen, man. we're going to deal with that. Okay. All right? But right now your body pulling down on some people over a phone. You guys can't understand that. No? You really don't know what else to tell you. You have plenty of time since the last incident to now to call the police. You did not. We walked we away did. from stop. Did you or did you not call the police? We yes, escalated, sir. Yeah, okay. You, you did. did. Then they, the they, they followed us. They followed us. No, this cop is not. There's no mercy here. This is a cold motherfucker. <laughs> Andy, we did de, de escalate it. Yeah, that worked out well. <laughs> you pulled out a gun. Okay, so you should have called the cops in the first place. All right, right? sir. I understand. I understand. Good. I'm glad you did. Okay, yeah. So that's because that people hit us. He's, he's fucking shaking his head in disgust, Andy. <laughs> this cop hates you. <laughs> Watch his head. Watch his head. I understand. Good. I'm glad you do. Okay. Yeah. So, he's fucking shaking his head. He's looking at his partner like, holy shit. That's because that people hit us. <laughs> yeah, but we just stand there and just take it. Fuck yeah. Huh? Maybe going to jail for aggravated assault. He never laid a hand on you. He doesn't have to. You understand also 
side of it. I understand your side of it. I understand you should have called the police. But because you guys didn't want to call the police and these guys want to start fighting again, you pulled a gun on I got him on video right here. He pointed a gun at three dudes in the middle of the street, 100 feet away, because he was afraid he was going to get his butt kicked. You should have called the cops 15, 20 minutes ago, and you didn't. Whatever. I'm glad you're recording it. That's all I have. <laughs> Dude, yeah, that's actually a good point. Maybe not record this conversation. <laughs> Maybe not tell the cop things. Maybe not record the conversation with the police officer. Maybe not add to the misery that Alex is going to be going through. Oh, did you watch the part where he yeah, assaulted him? Well, huh? okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. Hey, I agree with you. Uh -huh. That Why don't give you a right to pull a gun on somebody. Hey, just stop. Yo, hey, 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 dude. Hey, right dude. Now. Stop talking. Stop right talking. Right yeah, we just stop talking. Just stop I talking. I got a USB cord. Okay. Actually, it's on YouTube, so you don't even... Okay. Stop talking, alright? Well, you know, uh, good news, bad news, Alex, okay? Um, bad news, you're going to prison. Good news, we made 50 bucks in Super Chats, buddy. <laughs> high five. Oh, you can't high five me, you're in cuffs. Uh, well, yeah, a mental high five. Think about it, Alex. Fifty dollars super chats. I think it's worth it. I'm sure, your bail's probably going to be five grand, but whatever. Oh, Andy, what have you done this evening? <laughs> the super chats are still going through. Oh, you could have turned it off. I don't know if that's going to help your case. Was oh, it playing a song? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's playing Baked Alaska's I Love Law Enforcement song. That's amazing. When did you run in with you? At 2K. I'm talking, 1%. You doing that? Yeah, yeah. I'm great. You don't have to answer anything to him, so. Well, don't answer anybody. He's out of jail. I'm trying to sort everything out. How old are you? 31. You need to have any. We love our cops. Our law enforcement. We love our military and our forces. We love our cops. Our law enforcement. Oh, that is just, that's well chosen. Uh, I think the user was Knickers. Uh, well chosen, Knickers. That was a, a beautiful choice for a song. <laughs> okay, let's see. I think we're, it's, it's getting close to wrapping up. They're going to haul Alex away in a paddy wagon. Actually, you know what? Let's pause this. we got about another 10 to 15. We'll watch the rest of it. I'm going to read a, a few super chats here. Um, I'll see if I can find out how much his bail amount is. <laughs> and then uh, we'll watch the rest of this. All right, now give me a moment here. Let's see if we can find out how much the bail amount is sitting at. Uh, because I think that's something everybody wants to know. How much, what are the charges, if there are any, and what is the bail amount sitting at currently? Uh, we'll see if we can find out. Uh, just one, one second, chat. Uh, where are we here? Uh, let's see. You know what? I know where to check. Okay, it's it's coming, chat. It's coming. We'll find out how much Alex is going to get pinged for. Oh, it looks like there's some... <laughs> it looks like he's got a bug shot up. Uh, well, you know what? I'll, I'll try to take a look at that one. <laughs> wow. Okay. Sorry, it's a, it's a little slow. I, I know somebody's got to have the bail amount so we can find out. I saw some people saying it earlier. Not 100% sure. I just want to know the exact... If you could send it to my good friend, Mr. Anti-Bully, on Twitter, that would be fantastic. If we can get the bail amount, that would be good. Uh, let's see. A 
Apparently, this is his mug shot. Uh, he does not look super enthused, I'm going to tell you right now. Uh, looks a little bit upset. Pull that, pull that up, and see if I can find the... God, where's the bail amount? Come on, somebody. Somebody's got to get it. You can, <laughs> you can throw it up. Um, okay, let's let's put this up on screen. I'll show you his his mug shot. I'm not gonna. I don't, I don't want to put up any personal information. I, I'm just gonna refer to him as Alex uh, because he's having a bad enough night as it is. <laughs> I believe this is what people are claiming his his booking photo is. Uh, there you go. <laughs> he's, he's not looking super happy uh, with things that are that are going on right now. Uh, looking a little bit upset. I, I don't even... Is this even a current one? Is this from another occasion? I don't know. Uh, but there you go. Not uh, not the best of days for our boy. Oh, of all the... Sh oh, here we go. Somebody said that. Thank you to uh, <laughs> Robbie Pierce. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look at what we got here. Uh, I, I'm going to skip past that because I don't want to show his name. Is that going to... Okay. All right, here we go, guys. Uh, these are apparently his charges. Uh, simple assault uh, for $250 bond awaiting trial. Assault, ag okay, so he's got three charges of aggravated assault for a $5,000 bond assessment and a simple assault for $250. And it's all listed as awaiting trial. So what is that, $15,250? It's usually 10% of it that uh, that goes for it, I believe. So, you know, fifteen twenty five. dollars so they're gonna need at least fifteen hundred bucks to bail his ass out if he if he can get bailed out. That is uh that is rough. That is uh that that sucks. <laughs> Alex, you got my condolences, buddy. All right, let's watch the ending of this amazing story of what happened to poor little Alex as he goes to Big Boy Prison. Uh, so what were you listening for? It's whatever the chat uh, decides they want. Sometimes they'll, you know, like send us a comment or something, or sometimes they'll play okay, a so song. Out of your hand and we'll have you. Yeah, uh, there was yelling back and forth. Uh, there was no other physical contact. We walked away, they walked away. We went back to the guitars. I gave the guitars $20. We talked to the guitars a little bit of, about politics, and then we walked this back this way. We're going to go to our car, but we decided to talk to the chat and have the wings for a while. So we're going to walk this way. I love that this shit is still coming through the phone speaker. Do you think the cops are listening to it as it keeps giving suggestions? Andy's trying to grab your gun and shoot the black cop. Oh, what are you guys doing? Turn the fucking, turn the TTS off, Andy. Stop recording the confrontation and turn the fucking super chats off. That, that should have been the first thing you did, bro. We were gonna walk by the water and just listen to to the chat, whatever they said, and eat the wings. And that's when all of a sudden they approached us. Andy looks so fucking upset. He looks like it's just the world has crashed out on him. Oh man, I feel so bad for Alex. <laughs> what a shitty night. Alright, so they approached you what here? Uh, so when did they assault you? They assaulted me, you saw it on the video. Uh, well, they assaulted oh, me. The phone they assaulted me twice. Uh, they smacked the phone out of my hand over there. Okay. And then they uh, started punching me in the back of the head over there by oh, the... Oh, right, when your body pulled the uh, gun out? No, that, that was... They were separate from the bed. It was... They were on top of me. Something happened after, right? Yeah. By the way, I don't understand why you gotta take my phone to these stupid videos. It's not on my phone. Oh, we're gonna run you. So, I can show you that there's nothing. Alright, you're good, buddy. Andy, stop reading the chat. It's, it's what he's doing right now. Your friend just got arrested. He's got charged with three aggravated assaults. And he's getting put in the back of a police car. And you're reading your phone's chat. Turn the fucking thing off. You shouldn't have been streaming this.
Oh, you know what the fucked up thing I just thought of is? And he's uh, Canadian. He's not even from the U.S. If they charge him with a crime, I don't even know what happens. Does he get deported? Like, what what's the situation with that? Like, if they decide that he had some kind of part in it, if the DA or the prosecutor or the cops or whatever decide to lay some more charges on for whatever reason, like, how fucked is he? That's, that's like the risk of in real life streaming when you're not from the country you're streaming in. Also, it's so weird looking at failure clean shaven. Like I'm always used to him having like facial hair. So seeing it all cleaned up is really it's surreal. Speaker's not on. I'd also like to point out the difference um, between streaming styles. Uh, I'll never forget. Um, <laughs> Harmful Opinions was doing an in real life stream where he's walking through a mall, right? And he's just, he's streaming and stuff. And he gets confronted by security. Like, here's the difference. Um, and they come up to him and they're like, hey, we've got complaints that you're live streaming. Why are you doing that? And Harmful Opinions with the world's straightest face and complete deadpan tells the security officers, oh, I'm a convicted sex offender. I molest children. And the court has ordered that I need to have this camera on every every hour of the day when I'm out in public because I'm such a danger to little boys. <laughs> and the cop, the security guards didn't know how to handle it. And he just ran with it for like 20 minutes. He's like, no, I am a hardcore child molester. And I need to be on camera all hours of the day you don't understand so i'm trying to imagine what harmful would have done in this situation he probably <laughs> he probably would have really taken it to the next level It seems we've hit a bit of a lull on this. I'm going to skip ahead a little bit. We'll see how it uh, how it concludes here. Jump ahead a little bit. Still interviewing failure. Yeah, I anyway, we understand the speaker's off. I want to see how... Uh, God damn, they talked to him for a long time. Is this the end here? Oh, it looks like he muted it while he talks to the cop. Yeah. Oh, oh, a boomer moment again. Muted myself. God damn it. No, I just found it. I don't want to hang over them. <laughs> hey, do you, do you have uh, the cord? I want to see. I wanna, I wanna... He looks so sad. He looks so devastated. Oh, my God, dude. All right, let's, you know what, we'll, we'll, uh, I'll, I'll read the Super Chats after this. Let me, um, we'll just watch the confrontation one last time here. And then uh, you guys can go enjoy your, your Sunday mornings. And uh, we'll, we'll take it from there. I think it, ble er, ble uh, right about here. Okay, so for anybody just joining that was wondering what happened, again, Andy and his group were live streaming, got into a confrontation, gun got drawn, guy that pulled the gun got arrested, apparently charged with, uh, Four different things. Bail of 15500 or something like that. But uh, this is this is what kicked it off. This is what got the cops showing up. This is what got a dude arrested. Is that him? Is that him? Oh, God damn. That's him. Keep going. That's him. Keep going. We don't have anyone around here. Oh, okay. yeah. They're coming towards us. So let's walk away. Look. They're coming towards us. All right, yo. Stand your ground. I
All right, stand your ground. Here he, here he is. Stay back! Stay back! What? Stay back, stay back. Go, aim, 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 aim. Stay back, guys! Go, Alex. Stay back, stay back, stay back. Stay back, stay back, stay back, stay the fuck back, stay back, stay the fuck back. Walk away now. Stay back, stay back, get the fuck back, get the fuck back, get back, get back, get back. Get the fuck back! He was assaulted! Get the fuck back! We hate Nick. Get the fuck back! Aim, 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 aim! Calling the cops now! Aim! Stay the fuck back! Stay back! We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! Stay the fuck back! Stay the fuck back! Stay the fuck back! We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! Do you hear us? We will defend ourselves! We will defend ourselves! You go to fucking jail! You will defend ourselves! You're on camera! You're on camera! Stay back! Stay back! Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out, pull it out! Stay the fuck back! You wanna get shot? Stay back! You get shot! You get shot! You get shot! Stand the fuck back! They're walking away. Andy, do not approach them. Bailey, you're walking. Hey, 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 hey! Get away from them now! Buddy! Yo, get away aim, from aim, them! Aim, aim, aim! Buddy, you're getting shot! You're gonna get shot! You're gonna get shot! You're gonna get shot! Walk away! Walk away! Walk away! Walk away! Hold this, hold this. Do not approach them. They're walking away now. Get away! Hey, hey, hey! Go! Go! Follow them, follow them, follow them. Follow them, follow them. Go to jail. It's on camera. It's on camera. No! Stay back! Stay back! <laughs> so there you go, chat. Uh, the follies of in real life streaming. Oh my god. What the fuck are you guys doing? Oh, that was so stupid. That was so stupid. Why, why are you streaming in real life with a gun and a taser? <laughs> why did you let this situation escalate? Don't ever talk to the police. Don't make statements on social media. Don't stream a response. Poor Alex is sitting in the clink, waiting for his freedom. <laughs> Andy, Jesus Christ, bro. Oh, that is disastrous. That is just, that's a remarkable fucking strain. All right. Well, when I saw that, I, I couldn't pass it up. I mean, this in real life shit, it, uh, there, there, it, things always go tits up. There's always some weird shit that happens. I don't know what it is. I mean, it's great as a viewer. As a viewer, when you're watching in real life streaming and crazy shit happens, it's entertaining. But it sure sucks for the dude streaming. And in this case, for Alex. Uh, now, I don't know what will happen. Uh, maybe... Uh, the charges will get dismissed. Maybe they'll get downgraded. Uh, maybe they'll press charges against the other guys. Uh, who knows? But it just, it looks bad. It looks bad. It really does. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's going to go on. And I, I think, wasn't Andy staying with Alex? So if Alex is in jail, I don't know where Andy is staying. So if you're out in Florida, uh, you know, look on the streets. You might come across Andy Worski. Maybe, maybe give him a sandwich or something. Nice hot cup of coffee. Let him, uh, <laughs> let him unwind.